Back in high school, I was accepted to all the colleges I applied to, but found out I wasn't able to afford any of them. So I ended up enlisting in the Air Force, and the original plan was four years, get my GI Bill, and get out. When I went enlisted, I was in basic training, and honestly, that was the part where I didn't know what to exactly expect from it. However, I knew what I had to do to get to the Air Force Academy, and I used that as motivation. It wasn't until about two and a half years in when there was a visit for the Air Force Academy. My first sergeant and squadron commander sat me down in their office and said I needed to go to this visit. My supervisor was very supportive when I told him that I wanted to go to the academy. Anything I needed, I could go to him for any questions and he would be more than willing to help me. The admission process for airmen is almost exactly like that of a high school student who's applying. The only major difference is that instead of going for the senator or congressional representative nominations, we are nominated by our squadron leadership. Being a prior enlisted and commissioning through the academy, it gives me a better chance to empathize with the airmen that I will be in charge of and it will give me a step ahead of those direct entries that came in with no prior knowledge of you know, what it's like to be an airman. It is extremely beneficial for airmen. If you're considering eventually being a leader, think about the academy. I came here, absolutely loved what I saw, and four years later, I am proud to say I'm a graduate of the United States Air Force Academy.